What is up everybody? It's GrimYT here. Today, I'm going to be talking about my top 5 favorite songs from Mr. Eric Strojand, aka Boss Fight. So Boss Fight is a producer that I'm sure anybody that's a big fan of Monster Cat knows. Um, he was signed to them in around, I think what, 2017, 2018 he got signed. And he's been making bangers with them ever since. And it's a pretty inspiring story for him because he used to be making songs on Newgrounds. Uh, and now he's making heavy ass stuff on Monster Cat with some huge names like Philip Strand from Normandy and uh, Dirty Phonics among many others. So he's awesome. And uh, I decided to talk about five of my favorite songs from him. There's a lot I could have chose for this list, but I got my five here. So with that out of the way, let's get started. We're coming into number five, we have a song from his 2019 EP, Next Wave. And that song is Bad Mash. Now, this whole EP has got a lot of great tracks. You Got Me, Heat, Next Wave with Virus Syndicate is another great one. Uh, but out of all those songs... I chose this one because it's one that I think is more fun, and I actually really like the uh, style of it. I forgot what the name of the uh, the uh, rhythm is. I'll put it on the screen now. This is what it's like, the whole genre, I guess you could say. Um, it's really, really cool, and I'm really glad he chose this kind of style. It's really good, and I actually really like the build-ups, and the uh, main uh, drop and the second drop are great as well. But uh, the melody and especially the mid part between the two drops, they're both awesome. I think they sound really, really cool. And they're kind of addicting to listen to. I've listened to it like five different times. It's so great. Um, yeah, overall, pretty short track, but a really fun one. So coming into number four, we have a track from this year. And it is the world famous Endgame. This is a huge track for Boss Fight. This one, I think is his most popular on Spotify right now. I'm not too sure about that. But I know it's a really popular song from him. And so popular enough that it actually made it into Rocket League for season three and a uh, boss fight if you're watching this if you have any contact with cyanix please tell them to bring back the player anthem for endgame please i don't have an I, I i don't have it i need i need it for my locker i i have credits please <sighs> one day dudes anyways enough about that the song itself is a banger the first and, and third drop are great the middle part is what i really want to emphasize here he kind of like breaks it down and just goes nuts with the drums and it's just crazy it's such a great song and boss fight songs really don't have like you know distinct melodies and like distinct um tunes i guess you could say they're more about the drops which i actually really like um but i think this one here works really well it's a really heavy song and definitely one you guys should check out so coming in at number three we have a song from 2021 again and that is his newest single from June, The Pit. Now, this song was one that I didn't really play very much from Boss Fight. I forgot he even released it. So I gave it another try. And, oh, man, it is a banger. I'm telling you, man, this song's crazy. The beginning has this really weird, funky vibe to it. And then it goes into the buildup, and it's so well done. And the second drop is very cool. But the first drop, I love. It's got this excision-styled, like, bass and growl to it. It's so good. And I love Excision, he's a great dude. So this song right here with the Excision style drop is so kick-ass and I thought it was awesome. So definitely my favorite boss fight single from this year. So coming in at number two, we have a song from 2019 with Dirty Phonics and that song is Evil Inside. This song I think takes the cake for one of the heaviest Monster Cat songs ever. It's just so nuts and there's so much bass and kick to it. It's so cool. The second drop I really like, but the first drop, once again, is just so heavy. I mean, you got to wear a neck brace listening to this because you're going to headbang so much. It's just crazy. And uh, they even did a VIP of it a year afterwards, last year in 2020. And, oh, man, it, sh it should be illegal how heavy this song is. It's just crazy. Dirty Phonics makes really heavy songs. So does Boss Fight. So when the two of them came together, you knew it was going to be nasty. So, yeah, this song is massive. All right, and before we get into number one, I have a quick honorable mention, and that is actually a song from 2012, one of the OG boss fight songs, and that is his song from Caps On, Hats Off, Starship Showdown. Now, anybody that plays Geometry Dash knows the song very well. It's used in a lot of levels, and anybody that knows boss fight from Monster Cat has no idea what the song is, but to those people, I say, go listen to it. It is really cool. It's got this chip tune kind of 8-bit, you know, rhythm to it, but it's really cool. It has this vibe of like a, it's like a video game level. It sounds like a video game level. And after the second part, there's this really sick, like a uh, guitar solo. I don't know who did it. Like, I don't know if it was one of Boss Fight's friends or something like that, but man, it was so sick and it sounds great. And yeah, even though the song's from like 2012, it still holds up today as a huge banger. And all right, guys, here we are. Number one, my favorite boss fight song. Um, ever since this song came out, 
I think boss fight's been really going up. Uh, work from 2018 was pretty good, but after this, that's where boss fight leveled up for me especially. And that song is also from 2018, and that is Sovereign. Um, this song right here is just nuts, man. It is just insane. The build-up is really cool, and I really like the mid part too. You know, it's got this very kind of epic orchestral feel, but the drop is just ridiculous. It is so massive. The kicks and snares are just so heavy, and it's just, you can't help but headbang to it. If, if I could play it right now, just like the Panda Eyes video, I'm not going to play any of these, uh, these songs because they're copyrighted. If I could play this drop for you guys right now, I'm telling you, every one of you would be going like this. It's just ridiculous, and... It's just such a crazy... Every time I hear it, it makes me go nuts. It's just such a crazy song. And I'm telling you, Boss Fight makes these really heavy songs. And I'm glad he signed to Monster Cat. Because there's a lot of artists that kind of make more chilled out um, EDM songs. But Boss Fight is the king of heavy dubstep on Monster Cat. Um, and this song just proves it. It is just nuts. And my favorite Boss Fight song. Alright, and that is the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know, what's your favorite Boss Fight song? Because he's got a lot of great ones. And I know the ones I picked on my list are more uh, some of the more popular ones. But I'm telling you... Boss Fight is only going up from here next year, 2022. If he makes any bangers, I will be talking about them. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later. Peace.